SMIC 7 nanometers class N plus 1 foundry node going live by Q4 2020. China state-backed SMIC, Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation, has set an ambitious target of Q4 2020 for its 7 nanometer class N plus 1 foundry node to go live, achieving small-scale production, according to a CN Tech Post report. The company has a lot of weight on its shoulders as geopolitical hostility between the US and China threatens to derail the country's plans to dominate 5G technology markets around the world. The SMIC N Plus One node is designed to improve performance by 20%, reduce chip power consumption by 57%, reduce logic area by 63%, and reduce SOC area by 55%, in comparison to the SMIC's 14 nanometers FinFit node. Chinese press reports citing a statement from SMIC's co-CEO Dr. Liang Mingzong. Dr. Liang confirmed that the N plus 1 7 nanometers node and its immediate successor will not use UV lithography. N plus 1 will receive a refinement in the form of N plus 2, with modest chip power consumption improvement goals compared to N plus 1. This is similar to SMIC's 12 nanometers FinFET node being a refinement of its 14 nanometers FinFET node. Later down its life cycle, once the company has got a handle of its UV lithography equipment, N plus 2 could receive various photomisks, including a switch to UV at scale. SMIC is at the receiving end of increased investment. Despite a revenue of $3 billion in 2019, its capital expenditure is expected to reach $3.1 billion this year, as the company sets up a new 12-inch wafer fab in Shanghai for $2 billion and invests a further $500 million to add 12-inch capacity to its Beijing fab. The Chinese semiconductor industry is racing against time to provide the likes of Huawei with viable alternatives to cutting-edge foreign fabs like Samsung and TSMC. New U.S. regulation disrupting Huawei's access to TSMC will only accelerate development of sub-10 nanometers nodes at mainland Chinese companies like SMIC.